they were just playing physical in the beginning. Man. You know, they kind of knocked us back. You know, so in the second half, we just wanted to, uh, you know, play physical as well. And, you know, we were, we were just competing. I mean, it was no trash talking me and none. It was just, just no. two, two point guards going at it. <laughs> Not me and Kraft, me and Thomas. <laughs> But, um, like, you know, it was just me and uh, Aaron Kraft, just, just he big competitors. He, he had 17 in last year's game. How much of it was, was a point of emphasis to not letting him kind of have the flow that he normally does? Because he can affect everybody in the floor. Yeah, um, I mean, he was a big emphasis. Him and Thomas, I mean, because he uh, he's the hardest on the team. I mean, they go out and he goes. And he's a point guard. So, I mean, you know, uh, the coaches wanted me to fight him all night. And uh, I think I think that I fought him. And then my four guys behind me did a good job of uh, having my back. So, you know, we made Work a little bit, but he, but he's still a heck of a player. So when he, you have guys like that, I mean, you just gotta fight them as well. Did coach or one of the assistants talk to you at halftime about reeling back, reeling in some of that emotion? You're playing maybe with too much emotion. Uh, nah. I mean, they want me to play with emotion. You know, it seemed like you were. Nah, they ain't Not say nothing about me. On, 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 on the track of the nah, they ain't say nothing about me playing with too much emotion. Uh, they just wanted us to just get tougher. But you were different in the second half. You appeared more poised. Uh, I mean, I was just playing. I mean, just going how the game went, I felt as though they were kind of uh, out, out toughing us in the beginning. So I was trying to, you know, me and Tyler were trying to just tough them, uh, bring some toughness to the game as well. But, you know, we all brought the tough in the second half, so that kind of uh, calmed me down, I guess. What is your confidence from the first game of the year to now? It's been kind of a, uh, you know, it seems like it's building and building. You're feeling more comfortable, more confident as the season. Yeah, I mean, my confidence is definitely growing. Um, I'm just, I just want to stay sharp, staying sharp. You know, um, just, just, just being confident, you know, with my teammates on the floor and having confidence in them, them having confidence in me, uh, having a strong face, you know, having great body language and just trying to uh, be a uh, leader out there. Games like this help that? Games like this help that? Oh, definitely, definitely. <laughs> what kind of adjustments did you make in the, at halftime? I mean, the guard was pretty much erupted statistically in the second half, and that was a big key in those runs. Um, we just wanted just to fight. I mean, just everybody, everybody had each other's back. You know, uh, all five guys rebound. I mean, they they out rebounded us. I don't know the statistics, but um, in in the first half they did a lot more. But in the second half, I don't know. But I, I felt as though we got better on the uh, defensive end on the rebound. So that kind of helped us. And we just uh, ran our stuff and stayed sharp. Seems like your confidence grew as the game went on. Uh, the more it went on, the more you seemed to you know play better. Was it just uh, being in the game down the stretch, you know, being the intensity of it, or uh, yeah, just um, I just wanted to stay poised. You know, coach said something, uh, said that um, there was no body being poised out there, and everything. I think that's the point of our responsibility. So I just wanted to stay poised, you know, not force anything, you know, just uh, hit the open man and just uh, fight crap. Excuse me, the alley do you think he was going to get it? Yeah, I knew he was going to get it. Uh, I mean, he, like I said, he gets mad at me when I throw it too low. So I just throw it as high as I can just throw it, and he caught it. So, I mean, that's just amazing play by amazing player. Were you aware he was going for the dunk record at Duke, and he broke it in this game? Wow, I mean, yeah, I mean, he's, one of, he's the best dunker I've ever, ever played with. So, yeah. I mean, uh, he, he's amazing. Quinn, the teams you guys have beaten early 